A Metro East school was the target for vandals, breaking dozens of windows and forcing students to stare at boards instead of the trees and clouds. And then the community steps in to make a difference. Mm -hmm. This week's Harris Hero is a group determined to give students more light and a more comfortable place to learn. Here's Steve. It was 9.30 in the morning in East St. Louis, and not one student at Sister Thea Bowman Catholic School was in class. No, they were all in the parking lot. And the principal was in a bucket, high above them, wearing a hard hat. But I'm getting ahead of myself. The reason for all this happened back in 2015. The day before school started, 35 classroom windows were broken out. By big chunks of this, actually this is one of the pieces they found inside the classroom. But without the money to fix them, the kids went the whole year with boards on the windows. Eighth grader Nino Stezen remembers. Like, on one side it would be like really dark, and on the other side it would be um, bright. And like if we want to take the windows to get some fresh air, we couldn't. But then the community came together, donating enough money to put in new windows, unbreakable windows. Which brings us up to speed. That's what the principal was doing in the bucket truck, testing the windows. <laughs> windows paid for by donors like Kelly Estes, a former teacher. I've been here now for eight years in various capacities and just anything we can do to make this building hospitable for our kids and make a better learning environment I'm all for. And now Ameren, Illinois donated 20 grand for more windows. Donations of all sizes making a big difference for the students at Sister Thea Bowman. It's much better um, learning environment because you can focus more. Steve Harris, News 4. Mm. Individuals, corporations, so many people coming together to get new windows for that school. Great job by everybody. Seems like the kids appreciate it too. Yeah.